These ladies on the right have serious sight problems. They've come along to the My Sight charity pop-up shop in Nottingham's Victoria Market today to try out a revolutionary pair of glasses that can talk to them about what's in front of their eyes. They're very interesting and um, progress is coming sort of thing. I liked it because you could recognise people from a distance, which is my problem, yeah, no. mostly annoys me. But yes, very good. Basically now you have the book in front of you, so what you'll need to do from that point is use your right index finger. That's it. Yes. If you press, press it again. Yeah, it's gone back. It'll go back and then the, the, the one with the raised bump will go forwards so you can actually navigate your way through. It uses facial recognition and also text recognition, converts that into an audio signal so that someone who is visually impaired can effectively hear what's, being, what's in text all around them. So really they can hear what they're seeing? That's correct, yes. So whether they're walking around on the street and looking at shop windows or they're in a restaurant faced with a menu or if they want to read out of a novel or a book or a newspaper, this is what converts that text into something they can hear. The glasses can also pick up on people around you and tell you who's there by storing a picture of them in the memory. But again, you've got to press the button. I can't say just by looking at it for 10 minutes and using it for a short time. But it seems a remarkable thing for anybody that's sighted or blind. The Orcam My Eye has been used in America for a number of years, but has only just arrived here. I was very sceptical. Um, I know what voices are like on a lot of things and sometimes they can sound really robotic. And to have a robot voice constantly talking to you is not a pleasurable experience at all. But then once we got our hands on it properly and started to play with it, I couldn't stop smiling. So that, that's when I knew it was a really good product and it was really, really going to work. I, I could be like one of the trendies, couldn't I? <laughs> You already are. Well, I'm, I'm, I'm a recycled teenager. This is futuristic technology that can give greater independence and enjoyment in life for blind and partially sighted people. Jane Hesketh, ITV News, Nottingham.